One day, folks, you're probably going to die cold and alone. Good news is, you're probably going to be cold and alone on effing Mars. It's all coming up on this edition of Weird Things TV. I'm Justin Robert Young. For this, the April 22nd, 2011 edition of the program, I'm Justin Young. I think I said that before. No matter what, I'm just so excited, okay? Um, we talked about a little bit on the site, but, and, and I've been critical on this YouTube channel about NASA before, and specifically the way that NASA has gone about their business in terms of doing announcements. And specifically, I wanted to draw a distinction between how it's handled it versus how this guy, his name is Elon Musk. He uh, co-founded uh, PayPal, worked uh, with, with PayPal. He does uh, the Tesla Roadsters, the super awesome looking electric cars. And SpaceX is probably the thing that he's most in the news for now. Why is he really awesome and exciting? Because recently he put out a video and, and they made an announcement on the site for SpaceX that they were gonna have a big announcement. It was gonna be very, very big. And what they announced was the Falcon 9 Heavy rocket. Basically, it's a gigantic, super awesome rocket, the likes of which we haven't seen in probably 40 years when we poured all of our resources into the space race and, our, and, and the NASA program. And it can do all sorts of things. It can go to the moon and back. It can take things to the uh, International Space Station at a fraction of the price that it used to. But the thing that he teased the most was that we could go to Mars. We're just going to leave that out there. Just, you know, just dropping a little, little crumb, crumb of fun right there on your, on your information plate. Now, apparently, the word is that the Dragon capsule, which is what a manned unit would take off, and they're going to send, a, uh, send it out a few uh, times unmanned before they launch anybody in it. 20, or, uh, 2014 will probably be the first time that we see anything like that. Uh, it could go to Mars. It has rockets on it called Dracos that could land on Mars with pinpoint accuracy and then go back. You know, it, it, could, it could take people back to Earth. We, we're, we're seriously thinking in our lifetime that a, a private company, this guy, could be the reason why we put people on friggin' Mars. It's amazing. That's awesome. And, and, and when we're running, people running for president soon, uh, part of the debate could be, what is your Mars plan? Do you plan on initiating a program to send people to Mars? I, I, mean, am I, I think, I don't know. Some people might be skeptical about this. If you're skeptical, let me know because I want to, I want to hear more and more about it. But everything I read about it just gets me so freaking excited that I can't, my fingers, my fingers just do this. I'm trying to write. It's really annoying. I'm trying to write. And I'm like, like, oh, please fill out for your credit application. Now your name on this. I'm like, yeah. I'm on a first date. Anyway, so I went to Syracuse University and then eventually I started blogging. Um, I'm that excited. If you want more uh, weird news, go to weirdthings.com. Follow our Twitter, weirdthings.com. Uh, I got another video coming up that I'm going to put out about the same time, even though I know it's super bad. You can't put two videos at the same time, or else it's puts the views and everybody hates you. But I'm going to do it anyway, uh, or I'm talking about a bunch of stuff. Until next time, I'm Justin Robert Young. Stay weird! Yankee, Putin, Foxtrot. Yankee, Putin.